Oh, and what you makes you think I've been in there? That's the property. No trespassing. What investigation? For hell's sake, you dumb shit! I will show you my driver's license. Perfect. I will not give it to you. Okay, you need that. There it is. Your name, your date of birth, and your address. Well, you, I, sir. Hey, I told you I wasn't giving it to you. Well, I took it. Yes, On November 29, 2022, the City of Ogden Police Department, located in Utah, responded to a residence following a call from a concerned neighbor who believed a foreclosure notice was affixed to the front door of a nearby property. They expressed concern that there may be potential squatters attempting to move into the home. Contrary to the initial perception, the signage in question was not indicative of a foreclosure. Rather, it constituted a non-occupancy notice from the Weber Morgan Health Department. This notice specifically pertained only to the basement of the property due to a chemical contamination. Upon the officer's arrival, the elderly couple who owned the property clarified that the home was not in foreclosure. Regrettably, despite this clarification, it appears that some officers either struggled to comprehend the nature of the notice or chose to disregard its actual content. This observation suggests a potential reluctance on their part to acknowledge the sign did not pertain to a foreclosure. It is also disturbing that multiple officers even after inspecting the sign either failed to grasp its significance or opted to overlook the accurate information it conveyed one may even infer the latter scenario is more plausible the officer seemed set on getting the identification from the occupants and they were not going to squander the perfect opportunity to do so by properly doing their job we got a car in the back 25 is complaint house house where this was foreclosed on So yeah. Hey. What can I do for you, sir? So are you guys supposed to be here? Supposed to be where? This house. <laughs> Our kid just came from the garage. Your kid came from the garage? I just came from the garage. Yeah, is this your residence? Yeah, that's my house. That's my garage. Okay, you... What are you, what, what are you doing? We got a complaint that this house was foreclosed on? No, the house isn't foreclosed on. All right. You guys mind hanging tight for a second? Well, I've got to go. Where you got to go? With that? What difference does that make the So, yeah, you guys should not be here. What do you mean I should So, be? there's a close to occupancy. I was back in the back. Well, for this property. No, it doesn't say that. Yes, it does. It's on the front door. A partner just told me that. Hey! Shut your car off. No! We need to get this settled. No! Sir? You're trespassing. No, get out of the car. Come on. Come on. Out of the car. Now, what's with you? We're getting what down to what's going on here, all right? We got a I, call. I am leaving. I've got a place to go. Hey, it doesn't matter. We got this to take care of right now. What, what is this? Where's, am I under gonna, arrest? No, sir. Am this, I, uh, uh, then am I free to go? No, you are not free to go. You are detained right now. We're trying to investigate. If I'm so, not under what is arrest, your name? I'm free to go. No, you are not. You are detained right now for investigation. For what? Ma'am. What investigation? For hell's sake, you dumb shit!
Brown. If you stop yelling, I'm trying to explain to you. We got a complaint from the neighbor that his house has been foreclosed on. No one should be here. It has you not You guys been. are here. It and there is a no occupancy sign on the door as per my partner there. I, there is a sign on the door. So and what you makes you think I've been in there? That's the property. No trespassing. Yes, that's my sign I put up. So you're the owner of this property? I am. What is your name? You got a driver's license on you. I do. Can I get that from you? I'm not driving. Please. You were just driving. I not on I the need to, <laughs> Sir, ma'am, I need you to stand over there. You have to identify yourself. You need to identify yourself. Ma'am, stand over there. Ma'am, 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 that's fine. Stand over here. Okay? I, I understand that. I need you to stand over here. And we don't know that. If this was your house, you would want us to investigate, right? If people are hanging around your house, maybe you're some random person. I don't know that. Maybe I am. Okay, so we're going to figure that out. I will show you my driver's license. Perfect. I will not give it to you. Okay, you need that in there it is. Your name, your date of birth, and your address. You, I, sir. Hey, I told you I wasn't giving that to you. Well, I took it. Yes, sir. 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 Yes, sir
Tá bom. What do you want now? Chill out. You got my driver's license, you can see who I am. This is my house, you're trespassing on my property. Maybe you better call the SWAT team. I don't think you have enough backup. Are you going to give me my driver's license back? In a second. All right, that was one second. Do we already ask for so this house was foreclosed on. You're no, not supposed isn't. to be here. It's not foreclosed on. Right. I pay the taxes on it. Then it's not foreclosed. Okay. So since you're saying this is your residence, are you the owner, renter? I am the owner. Your name's on the deed. It is. Okay. It's under a trust, and I am the trustee. All right, let's go. Can you wait with him for a second? We're going to pull our car up. Yep. And that's what you three. Can you give me my license back, please? In a second. Okay. I am. Um, that's much red. I thought I was being really smart because I didn't know that your key fob to unlock your door has to be next to your key to work. I just found this out. So all my keys in there with my truck running and I can't move in. Okay. You're not the one that calls? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Okay. No, I didn't know anything about that until I heard Vera screaming. Okay. So, yeah. No, I said I'm totally separate from all this. I just okay. need to get my truck if somebody can. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I don't have a You don't have one of those things? Kit. Oh, no. Yeah, who do I who do I find? How do I find somebody that does? You know, none of the officers do anymore. No, not I know we don't. Dang it! Tow uh, company might be able to break in. Huh? Tow company. Maybe, huh? Yeah. Maybe that's a thought. At least I do got my phone. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Okay. That's all cool. Nope, she does nothing plain. She just uh, locked her keys in her car. Yeah, yeah. Well, medical's on their way. Come check out the cut on your head and get you cleaned up. And? See what they say. Do you need any further treatment? I don't care about the treatment. Well, we do. We need to make sure you're all right. That was a oh, pretty hard no. fall that you took. I would be all right if you hadn't thrown me down on the ground. Mm -hmm. All you had to do, up. all you had to do, was comply with what we were asking. Look, I'm a 78 year old man, and, it took, and you guys had to throw me down on the on the on the ice and the pavement and bust my head open. Well, that's what happens when you try to grab me and... I didn't try to grab hey, you! Hey, you're hey, we're talking. Let's just talk. I wasn't trying to grab you. Yeah. Now, what are you doing to my wife? Just They're just talking to her. Of course she's upset. <laughs>
about flashlight stuff and the super uh, and then yeah, at one point you did that for the drive. We didn't We are going to cite you with interference with an officer. I'm not going to accept that. That's fine. You don't need to sign. We have between 5 and 14 business days. Contact the courts to get it set up, to get it taken care of. No sooner than 5 business days, okay. no later than 14 business days. Doesn't that say this is not an information and will not be used in information without your permission? No, this Doesn't is your say that. This is your citation. You don't have to sign. You don't have to You're, sign. It's not an admission of guilt. Yeah, it's not an admission of guilt. It's just saying you'll acknowledge you'll contact the courts to get it taken care of. Like I said, no sooner than five business days, would no you, later than 14. Would you read that bottom right there for me? What do you mean? Right here? No, further down. Read that, please. This citation is not information, will not be used as information without your consent. If an information is filled and you're provided a copy of the court, you must appear court on or before the time set okay. of this citation. If you fail to appear to court, initial warrant will be okay, issued for so your arrest. Okay, so uh, I want an information. That's what I'm saying. That gets filed by the prosecutor. Well, the yeah, not file the this, okay. this, this is not the information. It will not be used in information without my permission. I will not. I, it is, okay, I'm, I'm so, not like it. I said, no sooner than five business days, no later than uh, 14 days, you wait longer than 14 days, a warrant will be issued for your arrest. I recommend contacting the courts. I would recommend you guys please leave. That's what, That's what we're, we're, we're trying to do. And you can take that citation with you. Well, I'm going to set this on your car. All right, you want to stand up, take the cuffs off, and we'll be out of your hair. So why did you come here in the first place? Well, I told you why, Mr. We Green. told you why you we came. said this place was foreclosed, and you know it isn't. Just get the cuffs. Just get yeah. the cuffs. All right. Ow! 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 You're not going to fight when these come off, are you? Just, How the hell am I going to fight? I'm a 78 year old man! Mr. Just grab the post right yeah. there, Mr. Green. Just what? get this handcuff off. Grab your post. Get just the cuffs off. The post. We don't want you to fall. Alright, you guys go. really ought to be proud of yourself. Your ID and wallet is on your hood, with the along with right your there. citation. Take care, Mr. Green. Take my citation with you. Nope, that's yours, sir. Thank you. 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 Yeah, cool. Yep. End of encounter. I ended up right there on the on the pavement, and then I could taste it. I could smell. I could taste blood in my mouth. Rand says he tore his rotator cuff and suffered bruising, and his wife is coping with PTSD from the incident. All I was hearing was hurt and and blood seeing the blood. This is the federal complaint the Breams are filing in court. They say police used unnecessary excessive force on Rand that night, resulting in physical and emotional damage. I'm not justifying being rude to an officer. Attorney Robert Sykes, who is representing the Breams, says Rand could have acted more compliant with officers, but argues officers did not need to handcuff him the way they did. The law is universally clear on this. 
being rude to an officer, you can even call them names, okay, does not justify the use of force. Utah. He was charged with interfering with an officer, and Mr. Brim later stated that he may have been too confrontational, but he was upset that night. But one thing that we know for certain is this, that is not illegal. Being rude or saying what you feel you need to say to officers is a constitutionally protected activity. Nowhere in the video when Mr. Brim attempted to grab his driver's license back from the officer who snatched it from him initially, nowhere can we see Mr. Brim grabbing the officer. But I want you to pay attention to something, and this is what a lot of officers do. You hear the cop saying, don't grab me, don't grab me, and he's repeating that over and over again. What he is actually doing is building a case. He knows that Mr. Brim never grabbed him, but he is using uh, excessive force. So in order, in order to cover his tracks, he's stating out loud for the camera to pick up, don't grab me. So later, when it's time to explain why he did what he did, he could state, well, Mr. Brim or the suspect attempted to grab me and it was a, a necessary use of force.